Helpless is a short story from Rosie Lewis. This was originally released in 2013. I originally read it in 2019. I've reread it again as part of my mission to reread all of Rosie Lewis's books. I couldn't remember anything about this. And on the one hand, that doesn't surprise me because it's very brief. But on the other hand, it's well written. It's an interesting enough story. And it's certainly quite eye-opening about how much pain a young child, a baby, can be in if their parent takes drugs during pregnancy. Rosie fosters a, a newborn baby called Sarah. And unfortunately, this baby is in a lot of pain, but the mother said that she was clean throughout the pregnancy. And the hospital are completely not believing this because of just how much pain Sarah is in. And I will say the descriptions of her pain are quite vivid. I think they did a very good job of portraying that level of pain, but obviously nobody wants to read about a baby in that much pain. So just bear in mind, it's not exactly the most pleasant read, put it that way. And I think it's a, a very brief but very eye-opening story about the dangers of using drugs during pregnancy because it's just really horrific to read. I will say it's not the most informative read. I feel like we never got the full picture about why exactly Sarah was taken into care. Obviously, one could say, well, her mother did drugs, that's why. But it's not very clear why she's then not working towards being with her mother because the care plan is is not to take her back to her mother and for her mother to do parenting assessments. I won't say exactly what the care plan is, but we never really get the full picture. And that's something that, that was a little bit frustrating to read because I did want to know, well, what's the backstory? Why is she in care beyond just needing somebody who can actually look after her to help her through this difficult time? I was definitely left wanting to know more about why her mother couldn't look after her and why the care plan was not to work towards reuniting her with her mother. Um, we do meet her mother on one occasion and it did kind of allow us to come to our, potentially come to our own conclusions about that. But again, I would have liked things to have been written down. It's also very brief because things move very quickly for Sarah, which kind of goes back to what I was saying. Why were they so certain that this is what had to happen to Sarah rather than leaving things open with her birth mother? But at the same time, I can understand. I can draw my own conclusions, but I wanted them to be confirmed. But Rosie only looks after her for a short period of time, which is why it's a very short read. And yes, I was left with questions, but because it's so well written and I think so eye-opening and addresses such an important topic about why you shouldn't do drugs when you're pregnant, I think it's worth reading. So bear in mind, you will probably have questions, but it's so well written that I'm it's otherwise so well written that I'm I'm allowing that to slide. I will draw my own conclusions about the questions that I have and I'll just appreciate that it's a, a very well written story that addresses a really important topic. So room for improvement, but generally helpless is not too bad. And aside from the difficulty of reading about a baby in such excruciating pain, I'd say it's definitely worth checking out. <laughs>